And today we're in Port Sheldon, Michigan, uh, out on Pigeon Lake, and we're deploying the weather buoy that goes three miles offshore. It's becoming part of a nearshore buoy network um, across the Great Lakes. There's, there's multiple buoys um, that are being deployed up and down the, the shoreline. And, and this particular buoy uh, was funded by the NOAA National Weather Service to get um, observations closer to shore of wind, wind speeds, wave heights, and water temperatures. And so it's really designed to provide a more accurate forecast in the nearshore region where there's boaters and, and more swimmers. The buoy is measuring um, all these different parameters, which are good for the forecasters and for some of the boaters that you know are actually tracking the actual measurements. Uh, but the buoy has a webcam on it as well, and it has a uh, 4G modem in it, and so it turns on every hour, sends a video clip, and then turns off, and then uh, sends that video clip back to shore. And so the webcam is really designed to um, just give you a visual picture of what's actually happening on the water. Um, you know, people can really relate to the image, they can see the wave heights, they can see how choppy it is, and it's just a really good reference on what's, what's actually going on. The information um, goes on the web, it's freely available. Uh, we have a new website this year called greatlakesbuoys.org, and that's where you can find the 10 minute updates from this buoy. You can find a link to the webcam, uh, you can find a link to other buoys as well in this nearshore buoy network. 